Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today on GTA 5 for a very silly race. Well, this is a boopy gun race. Now, we have driven this track a while ago. It was in the snow, actually. Uh, we raced around here. The idea is, well, very simple. We have a fairly straightforward race as such. However, around on various platforms, we have people armed with boopy guns. And their job is to, well, knock the cars racing around over. Uh, like that, for example. It's never like goes for a front flip. Yeah, basically their job is just to ruin our day and knock the cars about, make them fall off platforms, make them roll over, etc. Uh, it is um, an interesting experience, to say the least. Uh, we've got the Hermes up first that are quite notorious for falling over on their own, uh, let alone with some assistance of some booby guns. Uh, there, whoa, Danger Man has gone with a very, very big flip. Well, Amy got a hit, uh, however, the, the booby gun doesn't always affect. Oh, <laughs> Flaky, as is tradition these days, is uh, running around on foot. Uh, oh, I got run over by Longbow. Oh, dear. The booby guns have a certain amount of range, and there's no guarantee that if you get hit that it's going to affect your car. It, it seems to be quite random. Sometimes you get launched massively over, sometimes you just like that, you just get a little nudge. Danger Man was trying to put me in the pit lane. Uh, that will not do. That will not do at all. Come back here. Come back here, Danger Man. Uh, we're <laughs> uh, this is going to put Danger Man in a wall. Oh, uh, there's some some contacts going on. Uh, I mean, there is a race occurring around the booping, and Gliska has gone for a roll unassisted by the powers of the boops. Uh, there will be somebody to. Whoa! Okay, there'll be a Danger Man taken out of the lead. I mean, actually, I don't know if I want to lead. The leaders are falling over all the time. I feel like I'm safer not leading. Uh, oh, into the narrow chicane we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Well, I got... I rolled on my own there. I didn't even get assisted. So far, we've had one slight nudge from a boop. Longbow's got really flipped over there. Glisk has got spun around and collected by a danger man who does survive all of the booping. Uh, we've finally got going after a torrid time. And Lado... I think Lado was booping. Uh, I think Lado fell off a platform, maybe. Probably. That might be what has happened. Uh, there is... Oh... God, and Peg is gonna do uh, some boops. Gliska did a bunny hop. Danger Man's falling over. Oh, we've done a roll. Thank you for catching us. Uh, <laughs> Gliska did a good job of catching us, and then it's all gone horribly, horribly wrong. Uh, now we generally have a rule: the vehicle in last place. If we've got sort of stragglers off the back of the field, they're not to really be excessively fired at, uh, as our own little sort of catch-up mechanic, if you like, in this race. Uh, just to keep the keep the race interesting, keep the field close together. It's more fun when you have a big cluster of cars causing chaos uh, in all of this. That was a good shot on Longbow. Longbow's gone over uh, and has avoided. Oh, Blakey's gone on. Blakey's got a car. Uh, oh, this is actually the battle for the lead. Yeah, Blakey's got a car. After Blakey got ran over, they've decided to grab a car, and uh, they are actually in in the race this time around. Level eight's gone. <laughs> platform. Chris has not quite gone off the platform. Uh, I'm glad we didn't get booped in midair. That could have gone really badly wrong. Uh, in in, in midair, who knows what might uh, befall us. Uh, it's a good hit on Blakey, who has been spun around in all of this. And we've been spun around. We've made the corner, at least. Uh, it could have been a worse spinning around there. Uh, that hairpin... I mean, the hairpin's a good spot to ambush some cars. Uh, you get... Because we've got, we got to really slow down for the hairpin. Uh, but the angle that is, the, the shot is coming in at... Uh, doesn't do quite as much, not quite as much chance of rolling essentially in that one. There's a good hit on our leader, a good hit on Gliska. Oh, shots coming. Blakey's fallen over on their own. Oh, Gliska's going to save us again. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't think we'd manage to get it twice in one race. If I'm honest with you, uh, once was just one of those weird enough occurrences, but uh, yeah, twice now Gliska has saved us from rolling over. And we managed to fall over on our own elsewhere. But uh, it's nice sometimes when we have a car we can lean on. Uh, and Peg is going for some long-range shots. We'll now transition to shooting at us. Um, oh, Grisk is going to go round. Oh, and we're going to go over. No, we've cleared the wall. I don't know if I can get back in. Is there a way back in? Uh, I might be quicker resetting. Or I might be quicker just driving around this wall. I don't know where the last checkpoint was. Uh, we'll just get around the wall. That was a great hit. That was a fantastic hit. 10 out of 10. Uh, in terms of screwing up my race. I mean, I'd rather not get hit like that, but... Yeah, that was a, a very, very well-timed hit there to uh, ruin my day. 
God dear, this vehicle is not, it's not an easy car to drive. It's also got the worst diff in the world. <laughs> Just one tire fires through these, one tire fires through the corners. Tendency to roll if it hits a curb. Um, Blakey, oh, is pointing the wrong way. A solid hit on Longbow there. Uh, but I think the leader's just fallen off. I think this is actually the lead group now. Um, oh, Danger Man's fallen off. Amy's going backwards. Uh, oh, we're in the lead again. So we missed a checkpoint at the end of the last lap and had to go a really awkward way around. And we now somehow have lucked ourselves into the lead of the race. It's not going to last. It's not going to last at all. We know we're going to get hit at the hairpin. There's not much we can really do to avoid it. We can kind of chuck the car in and hope. Oh, did the first shot missed. The second shot didn't. Um... Well, that's fine. We're just trying to get going out of the way. Longbow's fallen over. Yeah. Ah, that was a good... It wasn't the most ridiculous boopy gun hit on us. It was just awkward enough. It was just well tied. Oh, Blakey's going for the brave. Oh, <laughs> Blakey went for the brave line and it kind of worked and then it really didn't. Oh, no. We're laughing too much and we're going to roll if we're not careful. Oh, we're going to climb over the back of the rest as well. Someone's just flipped out of the lead. I don't even know who that was. Level 8, I think, probably. It looks like it. And Gliss is going to go for a roll and miss the chicane. And Danger Man has punted. Oh! <laughs> Danger Man has punted the revs into the chicane and I got stuck behind with no other option but to wait. Uh, Danger Man has had a huge amount of momentum. Hopefully, Karma, in the form of a boopy gun, will catch Danger Man at some point in this one. In case you haven't noticed, I mean, the racing is not exactly the most serious when it comes to this. For, let's face it, obvious reasons. Um, by the looks of it, Danger Man might have been Karma quite nicely over the uh, railing. Yep. Ah, oh, like I was last lap around. Amy's got hit. Uh, we have snuck our way through. Oh, and then Lado got us. And Longbow snuck past. And Level 8's gone for an even bigger flip than I did. Uh, Longbow hey, is flipped across the finish line. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> trying to sort out. Normally, it's when we when we do races, we, you know, we have slipstream, we have catch up on. So there's this sort of almost track positioning you do for the run to the finish line. Here, I, God knows where you want to be. You could be first out of the final corner and win it easily, or you could be last heading into the final corner and all the leaders get booped and that be uh, that be that. We've fallen off and it's gone wrong for us. Uh, we will have to reset. And this is yeah, we just gotta gotta reset. We're gonna be never gonna be able to recover that one. And resetting. It's not too bad. Level 8's gone for a big tumble and is off. Uh, oh, it's still on. No, Level 8 is still on the map. You know what? That is a hell of a job. Uh, staying on the, on the track there from Level 8. I thought that car was gone. I don't know whether it got a boopy gun hit that fired it back on. So I'm pretty sure I saw it mostly fall off. But yeah, well, well recovered in all of that. Uh, Danger Man is slowing down for the hairpin. Oh, <laughs> we're going to try and put him over the railing. <laughs> Just kamikaze and the boopy gunner won't shoot us, I think, was the way to go. It was worth, I say, it would have been funny if we managed to punt them over the railing, but it didn't work uh, in that one. Oh, all is good. All is fine. I mean, the, the field is remarkably close together. You know, the law of the boopy gun does work as a substitute for catch-up uh, quite nicely. We've got crazy momentum, level 8's gone. And the faster you go, the more difficult you are to hit. Not only are you more difficult to hit because, well, it's difficult to aim, but also... The faster you're going, the less likely the uh, effect of the boopy gun, or the less effect that thing has on you. Uh, oh, oh, still going. We're still not being stopped. Amazingly, car behind us. Stevie's gone round. Uh, you don't want to be in the lead on your own. I mean, we're going to just go and, and try, but it's very easy to get bullied when you're in the lead on your own because everyone is going to be shooting at you. Oh no. <laughs> And now we're going to be stuck. I say, we're stuck for a little while until someone overtakes us. In this case, it was Stevie. Oh, very cinematic from level 8. Oh, thanks. No, even better from me. <laughs> that was awesome. That was a fantastic flip. That is probably the cleanest boopy gun roll we've ever seen. Definitely, in a long time, the cleanest boopy gun roll we've ever done. Um, Stevie's just got stopped in their tracks. Oh, and is off the map. Ah, oh, we got double booped in that one. Uh-oh. Okay, well, you can push me away from the wall. That works. Level 8, I think, took a boot for me. Uh, not intentionally, but did take a boot for me in all of that one. Oh, Stevie has flipped and not quite gone down the uh, gap. Uh, no, I think it has gone down the gap. And Amy's going to go <laughs> off the map. I think these are one of the most... I mean, we've had all sorts of vehicles actually running booping on races. These are some of the most hilarious 
I think. They really are getting thrown about by this. I think their tendency to roll on their own. Relatively large vehicle. Ewan is waiting for us to turn. I was trying to get Ewan to, to shoot the front of me. Now, the other thing is don't goad the boopy gunners because they will ruin your day. Uh, or they can ruin your day. Oh, sorry, Blakey. Didn't realise you were having trouble behind there. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, and now we have a little while to run around on our own until we catch back up to that pack of cars. Or basically, until we get to the next little hive, if you will. Next little uh, booping platform. Because, uh, yeah, down, down this straight, it's a little bit more difficult for them uh, to do much. As I said, because of the speeds involved, uh, the, the, the shot doesn't affect the cars as much. Oh, I take that back. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, Nareths. I was frantically trying to get my car back on course. And I could not quite make the chicane. God damn it. Uh, literally, as I said about the speed. Woo. Oh, the rest has gone over the barrier on their own. I think because he's just rolled for no good reason on their own. It just amplifies the nonsense that occurs in this race. Stevie's got the lead of the race. Level 8's fallen over there. Um, Galiska's pinned up against a wall in the final corner. Stevie got fired over the wall, I'm going to guess. Uh, so now Longbow has the lead, maybe? Yeah, Longbow has the lead. Longbow actually escaped away a little bit at the front. Gliska's got turned in all that mess. Uh, yeah, we'll go up. So we'll be in this fight. Longbow's got that little bit of a breakaway. It's not what you want. Sometimes you just got to deal with it. But you know what's going to happen. If you have that lead, if you have that margin, uh, you are going to be mercilessly picked on, basically. There's no protection. You've got no other cars. And sure enough, Longbow's fallen over. Uh, Amy is gone. I want to go to the inside so Danger Man can feel the wrath of a boopy gun, but couldn't quite get it stopped. Um, that was... Yeah. No, that, uh, the overtake was kind of on, but it was a bit of an ambitious pass, and uh, oh, it was kind of fair enough. Um, not much Danger Not what Danger Man could have done with that, because I had a big dive on my own, basically. Uh, so Danger Man trying to get it stopped uh, could only do so much there. And, you know, not that contact really matters. We're playing around with boopy guns. I'm not going to intentionally, like, massively torpedo somebody for a victory at the end. Uh, Stevie trying to weave and avoid. I'm going to take the uh, block there and let uh, let Stevie let the others take the bullet. Uh, essentially, okay. Now it's our turn. We haven't got a big lead, but we do have the lead. We will. We're heading down the far section now. Uh, if we get hit here, it'll probably be a high-speed roll, which is honestly not the worst thing in the world. Uh, the first shot did miss, uh, and they don't get too many efforts down here. Oh god, the whole. <laughs> Everything is, uh, yeah, flying around us. Oh, that was a, it was a good shot. It just didn't affect us. That one did. There we go. We knew one of them was going to at some point. Danger Man then got clonked. What am I stuck on? Stuck on the wall a little bit. Uh, we might have. Might not have been a good idea to get the lead when we did. Although maybe this will be perfect because they're all going to get massively attacked in the final corner. We might be able to sweep past and get everybody. You never know. You can't ever plan this one. It's too chaotic. So I really do that much with. We might be in a good place. Level 8 and Stevie, I think, are rounding the final corner now. Danger Man gets hit. Stevie's pinned up against the wall. Gliska's got the lead of the race. Gliska's gone. We're trying to use Gliska for cover. We have got the lead. I don't think anyone's going to be able to stop us. We will claim victory. I think Danger Man came home in second. We were in the right place. We were in the right place at the right time for that one. Yeah, Danger Man took second. Rats got third ahead of Stevie. Gliska ended up down in fifth. Uh, after all of that, Longbow gets fastest lap of the race at 149. <laughs> Relatively trouble, or let's say a more trouble three lap. And there we go. God dear. <laughs> we were in the right place at the right time. What a mad race. Oh, I love booby gun racing. This is always, always such good fun. The Hermes, we can confirm, work very, very well indeed. Very well indeed for, uh, for this one. So, we are on to the second round of this mayhem. Uh, I am a terrible shot, but I shall be one of the gunners. Uh, this is actually, this platform is not so great for the very start of the race. I might be able to get a car coming through here. It's an awkward, we're so low down, it's going to be a really awkward shot. Uh, and I probably can actually uh, get some of them. And Pega's gone over. Yeah, it's, it is a little bit of an awkward angle. The Warreners that they're driving are... Uh, quite low cars. Uh, not the lowest vehicles. I mean, if you hit something there, you'd never see it anyway, pretty much. Uh, but yes, my job shall be Boopy Gunner. I mean, we get chances to come through here. We'll get chances kind of at the final corner. Um, we'll get all of this section as well. Whether it's a good idea having me a terrible shot on this quite fairly important 
part of the track, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we're not going to reach. We're, we're too far back. But we can watch the chaos as Amy goes for a very big flip, and Ewan's going to get spun, and Lado's going to get stuck behind the mess. And someone flare gunned us, I think? Possibly? Probably? I don't know. That was a weird thing. Look, let's not start this. We can If we kill each other, because uh, we're being idiots, then we're going to take a long time for us to reset. So, yes, let's not do that. We might stand, we should stand a chance of getting some of them down here. I'm not quite sure how long the travel time is on this, or quite what the range is at some of these points. Uh, as the cars go around the corner, oh, I managed to get through the middle of everyone there. We're getting a wreaths over. Oh, I keep thinking I'm not. I've got to got to re-remember how far the uh, recharge time is. Oh, we fired the grey car into that mess of it. Oh, why am I shooting Lado? Lado's in last. I'm sorry, Lado. I just saw a car and I shot at a car, and I'm really sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was just mess up Lado's day for seemingly no good reason. Uh, I'm very sorry. Amy is going to be off the track. Right, slow down Amy for now. We will... Oh, that didn't really do much to Ewan. That one also not really do much to Ewan. Didn't do much to Gliska either. Now yeah, that one there kind of bumped them around a little bit. Let's not murder Lado. It's tempting. It's so tempting. I'll go on then. <laughs> I didn't do anything. We hit Lado and it didn't even do anything. Right, okay, well, I won't murder Lado next time. I'm sorry, Lado. It's only the first lap. There's always a, there's, you know, you'll, there'll be plenty of time to recover uh, from me slightly bullying Lado at the start. Uh, well, that's a really awkward angle. I think we got Gliska to have a wheelie and a crash. Um, but it's a very, yeah, it's a very awkward angle unless they go wide. Although Nerez, we've all got pushed onwards. No, stop murdering the cars at the back again. Stop being mean. Uh, yeah, we might be able to boop them. I don't know whether you could boop them through the wall. I don't know whether the boop transfers. Possibly. <laughs> You, you never, you never knew. Uh, it might, it would probably transfer to a person. Like if a person was crouched behind the wall, the boot might transfer. But I don't think it transfers enough to a car. Uh, way out of range over there. Can't do anything. So Longbow leads from potentially Impega. Yep, yeah, Nareths is in third. Although Impega's got quite stuck through there, uh, with a lot of booping going on. And Longbow's got spun, and uh, Amy's up on two wheels. Lado's turned up. Uh, we've got. Gliska further back is that one? It is, and we have Blakey somewhere. I think I think Blakey is back in a car again, at some point. But uh, there we go. Okay, what can we do to mess up the field at this high speed section? I don't actually know whether that's in range. Might not be. Uh, that's a little bit in front of everyone actually. Uh, that's a little behind the refs. Uh, we will get somebody. It's a big flip for Impega. Uh, it's just on the back of Longbow, sadly. And we will get Ewan! We'll do the pinball, the pinball, the snooker shot. Ewan into Impega. Okay, we're going to have to try and stop... No, it's not going to go far enough. We're going to try and stop a Longbow. I mean, like, we don't really... I say we don't really discriminate. We're just trying to stop the car in first place, pretty much. Uh, oh. Gun wasn't ready. And Longbow is around. And Longbow is over. Awesome. That will do the job. Oh, Flare has turned up. There is a Lado. Lado is gone. Uh, Impega is over. Longbow is trying to escape. Actually, that's quite a clever tactic. Uh, if you can get it up against the wall. It's difficult. Oh, pff. we find the Lado to bully. Of course we do. And Impega did a massive wheelie. <laughs> that was a good wheelie. Oh, there's a there's a Blakey in the wrong coloured car. Blakey, you've betrayed Team Orange. I want to shoot you, but I shan't because you're a long way back. But you betrayed Team Orange. You stole Gliska's car. How, uh, how disappointing. Oh, that one just went straight through. Oh, it's difficult angle to get, yeah, because we're either too low. Oh, the thing, the gun wasn't ready. I was just mashing the trigger. Uh, the angles, uh, no, not quite right. So that, that's the angle you want to get it perfect. It's a really difficult angle to pull off uh, with such a narrow, such a narrow window of opportunity. If someone does run wide on that corner, it's fine. We can get them, but then we're not really. I mean, we're not really positioned, supposed to be positioned to deal with that. I tried clear climbing on the roof of the car. I should have got. We're in the tuna category of cars. I should have tried to get the tallest car. I don't know what is. And maybe we get a slightly better view. I guess we go all the way up on the roof. We stand a tiny, like, 20, 30 centimetre advantage. Uh, we're not really watching it. We're not really watching the race. There's a big kerfuffle at the hairpin, as there always is. I mean, Blakey's almost caught back up. And that's that's how the catch-up works with this. You can, you can lose half a lap, and it won't take long to get back in, because no one's going to be shooting at you. Occasionally, occasionally I'm accidentally mean to cars, or we get a bit carried away. But, uh, yeah does happen. Oh, hey, we've got a spin on Impega. Not as impressive as I would have liked, but uh, it did the job. Gliska just got a bunny hop going on there. 
and has got flipped by a f shot further down. Oh, Peg got hit by everybody. Uh, we uh, I don't know whether I don't know whether we reached that. Uh, I think it's just falling short. That's a shame. Yeah, we only really get like one chance as the cars go through there. Uh, can we get? Mm, yeah, we're close. I mean, admittedly, where we're standing on this car, like you could probably move around the platform and get in slightly better places uh, for this. Uh, we're just trying to make the most of maybe shooting on a higher platform. How did that not flip Lado's car? Oh, god damn it! <laughs> So then there's the recharge. We'll fall to somebody else to do something. That was more what we were hoping for. Uh, missed on the next one. Uh, a little bit too high for that one. And, oh, big flip for Blakey. Uh, <laughs> of course it was. Right, here comes Lado. So we want Lado to go a little bit wide here, and then we might be able to do something. Yeah, we're as high as we can possibly get uh, for this. Ah, too high. <laughs> oh, there's someone else to get a very good shot. It's difficult. It's where I have the crosshair. isn't quite where it goes. Uh because the area effect is quite big. Yeah, like that. Oh, it wasn't recharged in time. Oh, don't worry. I'm not really, sure, really firing at you and, and all that. We can try hit there and see if anything happens. Impega just fell off the map. Longbow's doing a wonderful pirouette through the air there. Nice, Nicely done from Longbow. Uh, <laughs> if you see the car over the edge of that barrier, because at the angle we're at, you know they're having a really big accident, pretty much. There is the gaggle of cars. It is Gliska or is Gliska leading? Amy's second, Blakey third as they pile into the hairpin and Gliska gets launched not quite over the barrier. Uh, we're getting flared again by a danger man. I just think I don't have a flare to fire back, sadly. I'm all out of flares. Uh, <laughs> uh, the gaggle of cars are climbing up the hill. We should probably be ready as uh, they are about to turn up. Yeah, danger man, look the right way. We've got a Gliska or a Blakey. Blakey is leading the way. They have betrayed Team Orange, therefore they must be booped. Uh, even more so, though, we're going for Serpentine down the road. Not really sure whether my one is going to be all that effective uh, at that range. We are going to be slightly short of Gliska. And we get Ewan to go over. And miss Impega at the end of all of that one. And I think they're out of range through there. Okay. Yeah, I'm not the best shot. With this, uh, with this gun, what I what I end up doing, I don't know, you got to leave the shot a little bit, but what I end up doing is I get impatient, waiting for it to recharge, and I spam the trigger, and that just means that uh, I fire too soon, waiting for the recharge. Somehow, Amy survived one of those shots. You uh, had a massive accident. Longbow stuck against the wall. We'll help Longbow out. We'll help Longbow out a little bit. <laughs> All of that. And Bla <laughs> Blakey, having led the race, has now fallen to the back of all that mess. Up the hill goes in Pega battling with Ewan. I think Lado's in there as well. Can we get... Oh, I mean, it's a great shot through that gap if it wasn't for the fact that uh, the distance was just a little bit too much. At some point, we're going to get a car really well on this like that. Uh, hey, we got it. We got it going. We got two. <laughs> Figured it, uh, got, figured it slash got very lucky. I think very lucky is the way to uh, to call that one. Yeah, we can boop that wall, but I don't think it's going to do anything. Uh, <laughs> there's the best shooter. What lap? I don't know what lap they're on. No idea. They might have another time around. It might be the final lap of the race. See, we don't really know. We kind of try and keep track of, try and keep track of a little bit of what's going on, but you don't really know at this point. It's just when you see cars, you try and stop them. And that's about it. Longbow's leading the way. Uh, actually, quite nicely through the hairpin. Well, that no major problems this time around. A big wheelie for Amy, but that's about it. Uh, oh, and there's a flip for Blakey, probably. Uh, no, no, that's Gliska. So Blakey, Blakey, having been again a good miles back uh, at the end of that last lap, is back in the front. That's just how quickly it changes. In fact, Blakey is now leading the way once more. Uh, going for we're going for Serpentine down the road again, maybe. Uh, not quite. Uh, we will. Ah, not quite got the timing down here. For this, oh, we get long though. We will end up going for. I swear, some of these shots. Are we. <laughs> I swear, I feel like they should have connected and they just didn't, uh, for whatever reason. We will. Maybe we'll end up getting spun there. That's not quite. Uh, not quite going to work. Okay, so Longbow has got quite a big lead going on here. Uh, we will oh, get them doing a wheelie and bobbling and flying and crashing somewhere into a wall. Uh, Ewan can be the next one to feel the wrath of the boops. Oh, Lombo has got going again. That won't do. What? Come on. Come on, game. Now get impatient. Because I feel like these are not. it's not quite as effective on these as it was on the Hermes. I'll say that much. That's just a terrible shot by me. But uh, 
So yeah, sometimes we're getting these square on shots at relatively low speed and they're just not quite... I mean, they, they do get hit, they do get knocked about a fair bit. They're not the worst car for it, um, but we were expecting a little bit, a little bit more. Uh, so we might find whoever's leading come the uh, final lap might actually be in a pretty good position. Uh, we've got a couple more hits. I've got this corner here down a little bit better. Sorry, Impega. <laughs> that was actually that was quite unnecessarily mean. I do apologise. I was excited because I've got a corner where I can do... I'm actually not doing completely shockingly badly. <laughs> Sorry, Impega. <laughs> I mean, technically, Impega wasn't last, but it was a little bit of a low blow, that one. Um, all right, there is the lead group. Amy, Lado, Blakey, Kliska, Ewan are all together. It's going to change by the time I get around here. We know it is. Uh, the first shot, not quite done much there uh, as they head through the hairpin. There's a little bit of a bobble. Yeah, these, I mean, we've seen this before. Some cars just don't get thrown around as much. Some cars are just more difficult. Uh, we were expecting these because they were quite awkward to drive. They're quite slow. Uh, that they might be quite good for, for being able to, to get fired around. I mean, they've got to be lighter than the Hermes. But uh, the answer to that one there would be uh, not quite. Not quite. Lado is leading the way and going for a drive along on the kind of curbing approach there. Uh, sort of worked. Sort of worked. Is currently working because I'm a terrible shot. That's a better shot, but it didn't do anything to the car. We hit the car, but it just didn't, yeah, it didn't move. That's uh, not so good. Uh, we will not, not really be ready for that shot at all. Uh, we were trying to give uh, Impega a position, trying to uh, nudge Ewan over. Right, Lado is heading around corner. Oh, going for a little bit of cross countrying there, and going to get bounced. And Amy's going to come past. I think it's the angle we're at here. Although Amy did get stuck into a dead end, so that's something. Uh, no, neither me nor Danger Man could really do anything there. Uh, oh, it was the final lap. Lado got a victory. Uh, <laughs> Lado has taken a victory! It is a first! I didn't even realise it was the final lap. Lado... Whoop! <laughs> That's a flip for Impeka. <laughs> uh, the rest tried to run us over, so I feel... Ah, we're on fire. How are we on... How? That was a flare. How did the flare... Impega was the one that knocked us off the platform. How was it Danger Man's... F I don't even have Danger Man hit us with a flare. That's quite impressive. Uh, <laughs> oh. Yeah. There we go. There we go. That's some more booby gun racing. It's a wonderful track, this one. It's a fantastic, fantastic circuit here. Um, a lot of fun. A lot of fun to mess around with. Uh, I am not the best shot in the world by any stretch of the imagination. Um, not even, not even close. But uh, yeah, oh, we will go for it. <laughs> Wait, Danger Man survived. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This will not do at all. Uh, <laughs> how have you survived that? Oh, and it timed out at the end. You fell off a platform. You got ran over twice and Danger Man still lived. Anyway, yes. This was a lot of fun. Uh, thank you very much to Ewan for building this wonderful circuit. And congratulations to Lado for winning a race. There we have it. The first victory for Lado. That was going to be it for, for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. And until next time, a goodbye.